Hi everyone. So in AIMT2, this question was there. This was some 23rd or 24th question. I don't exactly remember the number. So you had to find the energy supplied by the source. And then I gave this answer. But this answer is actually wrong. Where did I do the error? I will tell that. And what is the correct answer? I will tell that. Okay. Thanks to one of our student only who pointed out this mistake. And then I realized I did it wrong. So what you need to find? You need to find find the energy supplied by the source. So I told you always if you want to find energy, what you will do? The simple formula is there minus infinity to infinity power into dt that's it this is what you need to do and what will be your power the voltage and the into the current into dt so never mug up any formula if these kind of questions are asked always you just need to write down this expression okay now you need to find the energy supplied by the source so current you already know current you already know current is 5 delta t now you need the voltage so you will mark this voltage this is v delta this is your vt now the same voltage is there across the capacitor as well so whatever the voltage is there across the capacitor the same voltage will be developed across the current source as well so now i can simply find the voltage across the capacitor so what the what will be the voltage across the capacitor since this is an impulsive current the capacitor will be charged instantaneously or you can apply the equation as well 1 by c minus infinity to t i dot dt i dot dt so this would be the equation so what you will get 5 by c 5 will come outside integration from minus infinity to t d delta t dt what that would be ut right basically an impulse will come at t equals to 0 and your capacitor will instantaneously charge by 5 by c voltage right your capacitor will instantaneously develop 5 by c voltage why is that so because it is driving instantaneously it is giving you a charge of 5 coulomb so it is giving a charge of 5 coulomb is equals to cv so what will be the voltage voltage will be 5 by c so instantaneously your capacitor will develop 5 by c voltage so 5 by c ut so this was the most important point i forgot this ut here i only wrote 5 by c which was wrong okay so your vt is 5 by c ut now in this expression you will put it minus infinity to infinity 5 by c ut and then what is your current 5 delta t into dt so 25 by c will come outside 25 by c will come outside minus infinity to infinity ut into delta t dt now tell me what will be the value of this expression will it be one or half let's check that out look since ut is there ut will start from t equals to 0 right not from t equals to 0 minus ut starts from t equals to 0 so this has to be put as t equals to 0 only this has to be put as g t equals to 0 only. What is your delta t? This is your delta t. The integration minus infinity to infinity delta t dt is 1. Right? Why is that so? Because we find the area of impulse something in this manner. Basically, this will be your impulse from 0 minus to 0 plus. So, this total area is 1. But now you will start from 0 to infinity. So, in this particular region, only this much area will come. So, the total area was 1. The complete area was 1, but this area will be half only. Are you getting this point? And then, ut is there only to multiply with delta t. Basically, this impulse only will be there and ut will be multiplied with that. So, only this much of part will be remaining. So, this is the graph of ut into delta t. ut into delta t. This only, this much graph is ut into delta t. This part will not come. In ut into delta t, this part will not come. This much part will not come. Only this part will come. So, this is the graph of ut into delta t. Are you getting this point? ut means the curve will start from 0. Now, delta t. Delta t is from min 0 minus to 0 plus. The area is 1. But since curve is starting from t equals to 0 only, not g 0 minus. So, the area will be half here. So, your energy would be 25 by c into half. So, c value is 1 farad so answer would be 25 by 2 zool okay so that was a blunder from my side i am really sorry for that particular mistake so answer would be 25 by 2 zool so this was a very good question but i did the mistake that i admit and thanks to our subscriber who uh, notified this mistake so i thought of making a video so that would be the correct answer 25 by 2 zool okay then thank you very much